Back again here for more Astral Chain recordings, more of post-game shenanigans. We're just going to be jumping in again. But last time we have actually unlocked round one's boss. And I know you guys want to see it like probably in this recording or this part. But I'm just saving it for the next one because, well, other than grabbing a brand new costume we can use for our bullshit. We can uh, actually have a better time because they unlock some more. Anyway, we get to do Maze on Forest, Zone 36 again, and then the third Astro Plane. So let's just start it off with Maze on Forest. Where in Maze on Forest are we going to be? What's even funny is that even though these zones may have, or the titles may have the same zone, since you saw like two uh, Zone 36s, the Zone 36s are different. In the sense of where we're going to be fighting. And it's really cool. Um, we are Maze on Forest here. The only one I can think of is literally at the top where we fought Daimos. Or back on the ground. Yep, I think we're going back to where Daimos was. Daimos. Diomedes, what the fuck? Anyway. Throw that to can actually grab a... Uh, None of these. Well, I should probably throw those away. Time bomb is not that bad. I should probably prog one down. Anyway, grab the remainder of this. I know one other of the plans I want to do for, at least for this, is to uh, grab more shit. Um, no more new operation? No. Okay, fight them. Yeah, we're just gonna need a sword. Yeah, we're gonna need a sword. <laughs> Come on, you sack of shit. Alright, more. So we got more new ones. No, we don't. The only reason why I do this is because I want to see if I'm missing one, because unironically, oh god. I should maybe put up a blue shield. Blue shield and then do it again. Alright, there you go. Much easier for me to do. That's the only reason why I'm trying to do this is because, well... I want to see if I am missing any more aberrations because those are, like, picking me random. I'll do this for now. You are a new one. Aberration mail. Alive. <laughs> One got instantly fucked. Open archer. You are a brand new one. You are a claw. Not yet. We'll just put a crash bomb here for now. We we'll have muscle drum. Use it. Use the missile drum for our advantage. Good. Good. Another one of these? Okay. Lady is. Lady for six. Lady eyes. Okay. Alright, go. Fucking. Mm, strike of the ages? What the hell? Alright, now we can do this one. Okay. <laughs> this is funny. This is gonna be a fun one. This is like one of the best ways to grab any of the remaining, uh, like, ladies that you're missing, or any of the uh, aberrations you're missing from, uh, just playing the game normally. I know for me, I'm not missing that much, but I'm missing a good chunk of them. 
Also, as of today's recording, this is probably the third Astro Chain video of the week. And this is like not the third break, but like the third like video after the second brand new LP, like more like impromptu LP that happened. We all wanted to, we all actually wanted to play Turtles at the time. And uh, we just said, fuck it, we'll play Turtles, I'll record it. Though, I think I prefaced this in the later part of, uh, in a later part of, uh, I think Mars Sportman, that um, we wanted, or I wanted to, like, re record that whole LP again. The only reason I'm still uploading is because, well, it was fun. It was like, actually a very fun, like, LP to do, very fun game to play. It was a great game to play, especially with, like, five, four of the people who did not know the game. But, yeah, like, for four people who did not know the game in general. But, damn, their first reactions to these were funny, even though, like, I think one of us, I was the only one who actually knew how the game worked, because, well, other than, well, I think I, I was, like, I saw the game from uh, John when it first came out. Ooh, boy. You are a male Gladius one? Ow. Oh, Jesus! Fuck. Stop hitting me. Fuck. Oh my god, no, 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 no. No, fuck. Now I can take pictures. Here, a new one. Fuck you, that one. Alright, now we can have fun. Yeah, but like, other than that, I actually want to re record the whole, like, footage for Turtles because, other than it being a great LP and we had fun, we still haven't, like, gotten to, like, the best part of Turtles, in my opinion, because if anything, with Shredder's Revenge, you can get up to six players multi, uh, like, six players multiplayer, which is very funny. And I really want to see how the game is balanced with six players in mind. Because with five, it wasn't that... It was funny with five. And how it worked with... Uh, I think when we originally played it and didn't record it, we went up to... With three people? Yeah, we went with like three people. Three people, Turtles, was the dumbest. We still saw what we were doing. We saw our characters, but... It was f hard. To keep an eye on. Also, one other thing about Turtles is that I know I preface this in another, like, I know a later part of Sport Mix, so you're gonna hear my gripes about that later as well. I'll say it right now here before we eat, before even more Turtles video shows up is that halfway through the Turtles recording, we actually took a break. So I had my just normal Discord up, looking at stuff in general on Discord. And when we went back to record the latter half of Turtles, I left um, I left the Discord screen, just like not like recording anything or anything. You still see the gameplay, but I had Discord open where I should have closed it. So like the thing doesn't preference on Discord more than OBS and OBS was minimized. So, yeah, OBS was minimized and I was recording with Turtles, which made the audio jar jargle a lot, which is very unpleasant on the ear sometimes. I couldn't even find a way to save it. So I just left it because it wasn't for the entire recording. It was like bits and pieces of it. And uh, another thing was that uh, the gameplay started cutting a bit. I said, it's like why I want to probably do another recording of Turtles. Because out of all the people we played with, everyone enjoyed Turtles and is down to play Turtles again. It wasn't that laggy from all five of us, and especially since we were all on different parts of like the Western world, we like to call it, which is just like three in northern, or technically like four in northern, in north, not northern America, in North America, and then one in South America. We want to see how the uh, game will handle someone pretty far. And we also wanted to see since um, I've been getting it. I've been wanting to grab a uh, do a couple of recordings for some ga multiplayer games we want to try on a virtual machine because I know I've been seeing a couple of videos from either people like I think like Arrow did Mario Party on a virtual machine 
and some other things like that. Also seeing some people play Marvel's Capcom 3 for tournaments on a virtual machine, which is very cool in my opinion. And uh, it was really cool to see that. Oh my God, more than one of I got all of them. And it was just pretty fun to see how to do it. So at the end of it, I figured out how to like make a vir make the virtual machine, make it work. And I don't know, we've been doing some other stuff with it to make, not to make the virtual machine work, but see if any multiplayer games work. Make multiplayer games work. Or alert, it did, and we have some fucking, get out of the way. Like we made some games work and all that, and we still have other games planned. But the only reason why we haven't done any more than the ones we planned is because I'm waiting to, like, basically buy a better computer to uh, record them. Because on a, we actually have done a test recording for one of the other games we want to try, especially when we're done with one of the games, because we look like we're going to finish one of the games pretty soon. And by pretty soon, I mean probably in for each recording sessions. We wanted to try a new game to record, have it also in my uh, external hard drive of shame, as I call it. Which will make it easier for me to figure out how to do it. But from our test, yeah, from the test recording, the only thing that I fucked up in the test recording was that the frames skipped on a pretty, not a pretty important part of the game, but a pretty reoccurring part of the game in general so i was like i'd rather not tell people to not grab that item because i would look more like an asshole so yeah i'm just waiting until i can get a new computer because it'll make it easier for me to record also for me to see if anything happens on the virtual machines recording because they'll the virtual machine does put out an audio that I can record with OBS, especially with Parsec. Um, unironically, there are times where uh, the audio just doesn't record. The audio just doesn't record sometimes, which is the dumbest fucking thing in the world. And you think like doing it multiple times, you get used to it to just, just to say, uh, hey, just do this. But no. Uh, it does that randomly. And I don't know whether it's because just it doesn't like being recorded. Sometimes just the audio input doesn't happen. But it happened twice in two different recordings. One for like an actual full recording of uh, one of the projects we did. Where I actually had to sit down in the editing chamber. To put ev like basically to put every single game or audio that was missed or game audio, not sound effect or I probably will hate myself at the end of it. Come on, get don't attack him. Attack this fucker. Come on, get him. This man is an ass. All right, where's the last one? Sure. Come on. And other than that, now the other one was like forty. 40 minutes, which is not that bad, especially if I can just like split it up into two parts. Nothing else happened in like the 40 minutes we recorded, which is an easy fix for that one. But it really did suck that it's one of the other gripes that the virtual machine has for these like multiplayer projects we want to do is that it just sometimes it just doesn't want to record. The audio just doesn't want to record, which is dumb. And don't get me started on other games where I feel like it's much better for me to just record off my own computer for these multiplayer games than a virtual machine because I'd rather not deal with four or two recordings of uh Yeah, two recordings for uh like two OBS recordings. And deal with like audio problems on both ends. It is a nightmare I do not want to subject myself to. I'd rather just deal with one OBS uh, problem at a time. Yeah, I'd just rather just subject myself to one OBS problem at a time. 
And if we actually have to get to the point where we have to do two OBS recordings, one on the VM and one of my own my own computer for like this recording and uh, my audio, fuck me, that's gonna be a problem and a half. Want to do a slow shot? I feel like we can do that. And slowly go down. Yep, they do go down. Good. Good, good, good. So yeah, that's just some of the stuff that we've been doing in the meantime while I was just waiting for Astro Chain to come back. Uh, I don't know, man. It's been fun. I've been having fun with the uh, other projects we've been doing. The only reason why they haven't been on the channel now is because technically we're not done with them. Uh, I will preface this by saying these are recorded way in advance. I'll say this. Um, the weekend for... Yeah. The weekend is that we have done one was five sessions yeah we have already recorded recorded our fifth session for one game and for the other one we have done our sixth session for that game so yeah that will tell you how much uh, content i've already recorded and all that shit just to give you some things we've been doing and for that, we've gone through the entirety of Zone 36 with just my uh, ramblings of what I've been doing in the meanwhile. This Zone 36 was just basically the, uh, the little hub area where we f were running away from the homunculus. Also, where we had to fight the good old Bryas as well. So, fun in all angles. And now this time we can actually finish with a uh, good old... Good old uh, astral plan, and we can start up the uh, next episode with the first boss fight. So, back to the command room we go. I'll probably keep this costume as well until we get the uh, new costume. But we get to finish off today with another astral plane, and we get two premium material codes, which is fine with me. I need them, but I need more rare than I do need premium. Which is surprising because I usually need a lot more common than I knew that I do need that. So, third Astro Plane is on the go. We are 17 minutes within the recording of this video. Ooh, let's see where we go because I know the second one was where we actually fought the Beast Legion. This is a, this is a mystery one. You know? I'll just do this now. Okay. This is a this is an interesting corridor to be in. Like especially because like I don't I didn't believe this would be one. This is just the uh, elevator before I think the end of. Ah, oh, I think recording me can put it in. Yeah, I think like editing me can already put it in. Of where I remember this in. Nice. But I'm surprised that they chose this for a fight. But I'm it's hard, at least. Nice, get the other small falcon out. Tornado it up. There you go, grab her. Good old money for me. We go up the elevator now? Yeah, we actually have to go up the elevator. We have to hit the uh, goddamn buttons. Huh. Cool. I know for me, I haven't done most of the uh, Astro Plane ones on my personal file because I just usually have fun with the uh, normal one. Oh my god. Beautiful shot me. Nice. Because my ass wanted to do that. Let's just go here, grab this chest. Venison. Okay. What else do I have? Uh, attack up and defense up. I'll take the fishy water. Crit up is really good, especially if we need it for a back attack. Take it. Grab this chest. Swap the beast legion. Get gasoline jelly. Okay. 
Oh, nice. Probably, need, probably shouldn't have taken that uh, fishy water before I came up here. Wasn't expecting puzzles in this. Go. Cool. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Ah, yeah, I remember this. There it is. This is like literally near the tail end of the other uh, fight. Got it. The only reason why I did that was because I thought I missed the... Uh, because the Orthos actually has a uh, tiny version of himself that you can grab from doing the Orthos fight or any of the... Uh, 12 fights that he's up in, so that's why I looked on the camera. Oh no, these are I already got them. That's fine. Let's go. Uh, what else is there here? What else? Oh, huh. surprising this one. Yeah, very surprising this one. Also, why the fuck is this? The blue shield up. Come on. Jesus Christ. I'm gonna leave him to pull out for a bit. Find this up. That? No, go back. Why did you go for that one, you goddamn sack like a crap? <sighs> okay. Targeting right article. The best thing since sliced bread. I think it's the uh, archer. There you go. Ooh. I right, friends, let's go. Yep, it's the uh, Callisto. Come on. I want to get their Callisto out. Wow, I'm surprised. There you go. Get the Callisto out of here. Okay, I was it still more? No. That was the last one. I would say, like, this is still more, you asshole? Really? A red matter removal? That's what you're going to give me? God. Fucking... Damn, bro. Anyway. Well, 23 minutes or 20. Oh, yeah, I can see 23. 23, 22 minutes. So either way. Oh, you get to hear the rambling of a man who has not done an astral plane in a while. But anyway, let's. I'm going to keep this cost. Yeah, I'm going to keep this uh, color scheme for the next part. But that should be enough for me, though. Anyway. Next time on Astro Chan, we're actually going to be doing the first boss fight for um, round one. And as soon as you finish that first boss fight for round one, you get to open up more of the uh, cases. So yeah, this is the only one we're going to do. And then after beating the first boss for round one, we're going to be doing the next two of round ones. We've done all the Astro Flames we can do for now. We have done desk work and we have done the previous five and also if you want to get a pretty good um like if anything if you want a just a a power core that fits your style of gameplay i think probably for me i might be doing some of these off screen especially for stuff like anti-decibel anti-slime um and also stuff like anti-freeze and anti-flame you can do these missions all over again to just get the ones you want but out of the way Thank you all for joining me today. Hopefully you guys are going to be enjoying the other two OPs in conjunction with Astro Chain because I know for me, I'm probably going to be recording a bunch of Astro Chain. And I know from by the time we finish round one and get to, I think, halfway through round two, it's going to be switching back to post commentary, which means there's going to be some jumps between videos. I'm just trying to record all around one before I have to go sit down and do voiceovers for round two. So thank you all for joining me today as well. And it's I already said that. What the fuck? But yeah, just like I said, I'll see you in credits.